Alright. Part 11 of Banjo. Oh man. Okay, basically you're almost done with this level, right? You had a few more missions? Uh, two more Jinjos and I gotta get the honeycomb. Oh yeah, and the end of this challenge. But in a sense, this part here took me about six or seven times. <laughs> five to seven times. Yeah. Because as you're gonna see here, you barely have enough time to get up there, even with the rain shoes. Yeah, thanks, Rare, for this section, really, like... Look at three se like... And the issue is... Yeah, let's see, there you go. So, what would happen is that even when I have an, even when I make it when it's open, the lid will start to open, I mean, start to close, and because of Kazooie, when you run up a edge, she goes forward, like in the air. She doesn't just drop, she goes forward. She goes flying. So, as I run out of time, the door will close, and Kazooie will land on the door and lift me up. Like, you barely made it that long. Yeah, I, I had to skip to the side so I didn't go on the fucking um, door again, so. Um, so, oh. yeah, no, that one's a little, like, that's way too tight. Um. <laughs> I think it was nothing up here to go. Oh, just the... Nothing oh, up oh, here. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> and then you just had... I, I just had to collect the Jinjo. Do, do keep shady. in mind, do keep in mind, this was when we did like live, live commentary, so we could be joking, we could be talking about something. So, you know, I couldn't tell sometimes just like... I'm just standing here, or like I'm just doing nothing. It's like, okay, were we chatting about something? Were we joking? Because there are times where we just don't move and we just like chat. <laughs> I think I <laughs> recall, know. yeah, we were talking about something here. I think I mentioned how the goofy face or some shit, I don't know. Oh, yeah. We were talking about something about the face or something. Oh, yeah. Oh, you told me how that it's a smiley face. It's a goofy face, you told me while you were just standing there. Buddy, they didn't really get near you. <laughs> you were like just right there. No, they didn't. Yeah, I'm like they're like you were right there in the pro their proximity, but they were just eh, it's just how the enemies. They don't going. love me. <laughs> I don't think there was nothing on those eyes neither. Yeah, no, you're telling me that. No, they're just there. I'm like, oh, okay. It's just for the aesthetic. And they were talking about the face or something, or making a joke or whatever. Now, this makes it a little easier to get the notes. It's the only way to get the notes. Yeah, what, mean, do you, what do you mean? There's no boots. I in. did the hard way. <laughs> as a kid. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I probably did too, but I don't have... I, I don't have much memory, so... Uh-oh, yeah, then they... <laughs> yeah, they put the ginger down here. Ginger! That's ten pieces, so enough to go to the next world, too. I kind of wish they had like an animation just like Mario has with the star underwater. Oh, yeah. Where he slowly does the backflip like and goes, let's go. go. <laughs> Alright, so I almost die here. <laughs> Wait for it. <laughs> Wait for it. <laughs> there. there we go. I think you get an extra honeycomb too. Yeah, I do. I get full restore right back. <laughs> I think after that, you, you get like that. If you get filled it again, you get like six in total. No, one more. And then when you do the secret door. Oh, and then I told him where the last piece is. Yeah, those. so five minutes go by, and like he's just like, oh, it's in that one place. I'm like, no, I already checked. And then like went back to the cycle like, case. Okay, you arrived. <laughs> yeah. Anyways, Gobi Desert. Everything in 4617. I mean, we promised ourselves we weren't going to try to 100% it, but I don't know. Something in us just kept saying, let's 100% this. And I think this is where we. No. This is like when you get the G. Oh, oh yeah, you got. I got fucking clothesline. I think this is. I think this is still me playing. Yeah, you're still playing. Yeah. Like you're not that careful. <laughs> from that, you mean? Because like I could see. Hey, I made it exciting, didn't it? Basically. <laughs> didn't I? Basically. They call me Two Face. <laughs> oh boy. Anyways, here's the switch off. Now it's a switch right here. Oh, I was trying to get back. Yeah, no, Jesus had to readjust because, once again, he's a PlayStation guy in an Xbox, so he had to familiarize himself with the control again. And it was a 64 version of this game, too, so... Yes. Freeze... 
Was oh, it? oh, the amount I had to edit out in this part. Oh, God. <laughs> Hello, French. Because <laughs> we already beat Breezy Pete. Breezy. You needed to do the race again. Oh, right. The beat. Because you needed the running shoes. Because the second race is Banjo Kazooie. Yeah, you couldn't really complete this level without. Here we go. There's Gobi. He went for the health first, I think. No. He was looking for the shoes. They spawn in when you accept. Oh, 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 oh. Or the chicken out. I'm no chicken. And his two chickens out. <laughs> and they're like, wait. I, I was telling him, this is like, dude, you gotta press A. And you press B. <laughs> yeah, so not used to an Xbox controller. It's like a reverse Nintendo controller because... Oh, and I got <laughs> beamed right there. You see why I hate the snowman so much in this one? Look at that. I was just like, Jesus. Jesus. Really, these oh my goodness, this is. Oh my god. Like, a part of it is, like, I remember, like, Jesus is, like, getting uh, configured to the, the controller again, but another part of just like, come on, Jesus, come on. Like, don't disappoint me. <laughs> <laughs> I like how he dashes away before I can even get to the shoe. Like, you motherfucker. Hey, hey, not as bad as the rabbit, bro. No, not as bad as the fucking beetle, bro. Oh, that's true. I hate the beetle too. That's a beetle. Okay, so just like the first phase, there's rubber band in this game. Look, like, he's about to rubber band right now, actually. Like, I yep, can't, there yeah. You go. So, but, one good thing is to just try to be in front of him. And he'll push and you. And I was telling his suits, just like the seal, to jump with Kazooie. Well, not on, not on even floor. He now, slows when, down right here. No, what you're supposed to do is you're supposed to jump on an incline, and Kazooie goes flying. I was telling him, who's that? He's gonna put it right here. And he caught up that much. I was just like, jump, his just jump. <laughs> and here and I try jump, to jump, jump, like jump, crazy. jump. <laughs> like, I was telling him, was like, jump, his and there were times where he didn't jump, and I was like, come on, he says, jump. <laughs> like, I I'm trying to help, help you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but Jesus brought that back. He did, I did bring Thanks that back. Thanks to my advice. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I don't mind. Hey, you, you gotta know the little cheese thing. Trees and cheese tips, you know? Yeah, I, let me see. I don't know what, what was. No, no, I'm sorry, those are called cheese sticks. I forgot what uh, cheese strats. Uh, uh, Mozzarella. <laughs> I'm more of a pepper jack person or <laughs> cheddar, but okay. <laughs> uh, I think you mean Swiss. Ah, uh, Swiss. I think I was trying to get something else to. Oh yeah, now I remember. This is pretty tight. A lot of this, a lot of this timing stuff is really tight in Banjo. Minus the points where the timer starts before you actually move. <laughs> I remember when I thought I made it. I was like an idiot for that. You took over your frustration on that guy, though. Yeah, I did. After several tries, I got it right. Um, that was your third attempt. Yeah, after several tries. All right, I'm gonna go underneath. Oh, oh, this is the re the return of the snowman fight. Yeah, I wanted to get revenge on this fight. Yeah, you did. Oh. He almost nailed you there. And I hit myself. And got a reset. Yep. Many years later. Well, Juan told me it wasn't worth it. It's like, it's not worth it. It's like, no, the snowman's gotta die. <laughs> I just said, fuck it, just stay here. <laughs> so sweet. Oh my god. Okay. You still got it, ironically enough. <laughs> and this time you went the top path, because the Grin Grintendo Switch has the jiggy on the top. Yeah. You couldn't get it until you got the shoes, so they they do make you backtrack a bit in this game. As rare games do, they no do. matter what game it is. Oh yeah, definitely. Like Metroid has that kind of issue, too. And that's some... uh, that's a Metroidvania game, though. It, that's part of the genre, though. Yeah, I mean, like, the one that does it a lot, majority, is, like, Super Metroid with glitching. You could get breakthrough, like, so much in that game. I know, but, like, what you have to do, man, 
man mandatorily, you know? Yeah. Because you gotta remember, like, there are times where you get the super missile or the the, the mines. You gotta go yeah. back and break certain blocks to get upgrades or missile capacity or, you know, to a new area. You can see the seams of all the fucking textures, too. Thanks, HD. <laughs> There, there we you go. go. Your reward is a honeycomb. I was expecting they give me something else. Nope. By killing it. I know. I wasted a lot. That's why I told us it wasn't worth it. <laughs> it's not worth it's, it. It's like, not worth it, man. It's like this fucker's been laughing at me, throwing <laughs> snowballs. He definitely <laughs> like I don't care. What is life? <laughs> <laughs> what is life? Baby, don't hurt me. <laughs> Fuck you. Oh my god. What was? That? Oh my god. I was gonna say the term that. I think it was backseat playing, I think that's what they call it. Some streamers call it. Yeah, backseat where one plays and the other person's just like telling you what to do or Yeah. Or just like you know, telling you it's like, Oh you should do this or whatever. I didn't mind. It was just it was funny because like he but in a way he shows it in a comedian he tells me in the funny way, like, do it and I'm like, No Who? Oh. Um, when you know you told me like the advice for this. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh for the oh yeah, for like the race, whatever. Yeah. Yeah, like, don't get me wrong, like, I, I mean, I played Banjo Kazooie, like, a long time ago. Like, I don't. Oh, I almost died a few times because I hate how it blends in if you're not paying attention. Bro, if you think this is bad, PK64, it's worse. Oh, yeah. But the only difference is it's not in, it's not always in skill, though, is the issue. Because like, even if you went down there, there's no way to get back up, so that's why they made insta kills. Like, you're, if you fall down, you can't get back up anyway, so yeah, that's have... why they made it insta kill. And then I think we're on the next section, unless I didn't open. You, we, yeah, no, you didn't open it yet. Like, this is the way, but the door wasn't open yet. But I mean, like, yeah, no, like, I'm not, like, speedrunner, like, bro, like, I know, like, a lot of shit. Because obviously, he has had to point out a lot of stuff for me. And so, as I pointed out for him, you know, but, like, I do know some things. And I was an idiot for not doing this in the first place. Oh, breaking the gate. Yeah. Because when we come back as a pumpkin. Yeah, you had to break that before. Yeah, I, I had to go back to Monster Bash. No, no, I had to like exit, come back, go back in the world, and then. <laughs> I think this is right. Oh, it's, never mind. It's okay. I cut out a lot. <laughs> <laughs> we were just going in circles trying to find the. the... Oh no! I think that's the hardest thing about this game is that we. Didn't know where the place was to open the next area or whatever. So, and I kind of like messed up for a bit. <laughs> I think it was that one section where I kind of had to keep jumping. Bro. <laughs> the amount of time I had to edit out on this. Well, not this one. This one's towards, um, Rusted Bucket Bay. Oh, yeah. Yeah, trying to find the opening for that level over there and I think I was trying to look for <laughs> if people were saying we're wasting your time I I had to edit a lot of time yeah you pretty much covered for all my stuff so <laughs> I apologize in advance it's okay remember like the old, old other parts like I had to like look for was it the swamp area or what I had, I, swamp. yeah like there was plenty of time where I well, was like what to like the second <sighs> Was it? We didn't know where to go if, from like the beginning of the game, anyway. So you know, there's nothing new. Yeah. Uh, the only difference is just messed up big time in the platform because there's no ledge hog in this fucking game. Yeah, you can't grab ledges in it until, until two. Sui. Which is so stupid. But, but they they uh, designed it so that you can just normally platform in this game. Though. Oh yeah. I don't know if they designed it like that. So they didn't have to put ledge hog in ledge hog, you know, but like, you know. That's one. <laughs> the thing is like oh the thing is is that Jesus okay. The thing is that Jesus was jumping and cutting too much of the wall. Cause he could be going more forward in. Like that. Yeah. He kept on doing that <laughs> a lot. I think I was talking to you about something before I started putting all the pieces in. 
No, there we were go. trying to figure out which button to put on. Yeah. It's been a while. I think it was like the A button, Y button, I think. It's like Y or red trigger or something like that. Something like that. We're trying to find it. We're trying to find it. We're trying to find it. There, there we it go. <laughs> Mad Monster Mansion. Apparently, it's a stage in Remix, so it's kind of teasing that maybe Banjo might be in Remix along with the new character they announced, Go Gomon. Well, Banjo is after, after Smash 64, so we'll see. Well, the funny thing about it, this, about it... I mean, it, it's good for a reference, but I don't, yeah. I don't expect Banjo to be in the remix. I mean, it would be cool because, like, all the characters that were announced in Remix were technically used to prove a guy who tried to scam a bunch of people out of their money. For, I think you mentioned this today before. Yeah, there was a scam going on. Someone called it Smash 64 in... Like Infinity, I forgot what it was called. Right. Like, or they were gonna add Rayman, Gomon, Bomberman, Banjo Kazooie. Oh, okay, yeah, no, I remember that. I remember that because I remember Bomberman was one of the characters. Yeah, Rayman, Bomberman, Go, Gomon, Falco, Banjo were all on that list. Oh, that was an old one actually. Hmm? Mm -hmm. That's an old one, old scam. Yeah, but that's what caused the project remix team to make it to prove that like you don't need money to make make the game oh no no if you're able to program shit you can basically make whatever oh yeah it just takes time yeah also um so just a little note for people i'm trying not to die because <laughs> just like uh well basically whenever you die in banjo everything resets yeah, and uh, you need certain things broken for the pumpkin mm-hmm so, make sure not to die. Spoilers. As soon as die. Once. Because I was After blind. all, this is done, though. Yeah. Because <laughs> I was blind. Because I didn't, wasn't paying attention where I was going. I blame myself for that. <laughs> trying to... Oh, yeah. What's the matter with You were trying to do the gold feather. Because... Um, right on the stick. Um, what was it? Because all they know, Banjo Legend moves pretty fast. Oh, yeah. Like, his, his character speed is pretty fast. I mean, Jesus was done this section, but it's just like, no, you die. <laughs> Those ghosts are annoying. They're gonna get, they're gonna keep intercepting you, so I had to get rid of them. Even though the ginger is like the last thing you needed in here, anyways. But, okay. Yeah, there's certain points where I was, I was telling us, it's like, alright, Jesus, go. And you're all like, no, it's gotta die. I'm like, this is. <laughs> it's like, it's better. I, I mean, it's one thing for, to be thorough, and I understand that, but a part of me is just like, when you realize your your, your job is done in the job in the section, it's like, it, it's it's good enough to leave. <laughs> oh god, has to the fucking gutter. Oh god, you tilted me so much, bro. Because <laughs> there's some point where you're like. You're trying to get on the roof, but you're landing on the fucking tiles, and you get the slitting off. I'm like, yes, just land on the gutter. Land on the gutter. <laughs> it's like, land on the part where you don't slide. This is just like, slide. <laughs> slide. <laughs> slide. <laughs> well, I mean, I'll, I'll show where the spot is, but like, this. <laughs> oh, my God. It's, Mars, it's not Mars 64. <laughs> Actually, though, that said, um, that's that's something they changed in um, Mario Mario 64 DS actually, because they made the bosses their own paintings actually. Oh yeah. If you remember that, <laughs> you try to peck the guns until the picture makes you remember like the it's like Goomba King or something like that. Like that monster. Like all yeah, like all the bosses in the world, you basically have to like um go through their own window. Which is like, I think another callback to Mario Kart 2, yes. Oh, yeah. Because there was, um, they had, uh, besides the missions, they had bosses. And they had, like, another world if you didn't, like, star rank or A rank all the worlds yet. Which was a race against Wiggler, who was, like, the true final boss. I had, um, Diddy Kong PTSD when I found that. And then this mission where you had to be really quiet. Oh. Well, you had to go behind him. 
He had to land in the chimney like uh He had to go in the chimney to, to sneak up on him. I just wanted to get some of the notes on that chair. Yeah. Yeah, you're supposed to go in the chimney, jump on the chair, jump on the other chair, jump on the table and like sneak up right behind its ass and then get it. But as of right now, you just get through the windows. I mean, just use... I assume he was going to be a boss battle in this game because I saw some of the gameplay where it showed like Banjo throwing eggs at him. But no, it wasn't like that. That's what I assume because I saw the trailers for this game. Right. Back in the old days. Back when I was still young. <laughs> <laughs> no, conquer. And then here, we get, here's again, they got, this is where you wanted me to, I was trying to do no, the talent truck. No, no, it wasn't there, it wasn't there that I was talking about. I was trying to talent truck. Yeah, I think you can break, yeah, there's another window I broke here. Vandalism. <laughs> Alright, sorry for the question, folks. The family just asking for assistance with something. That's usually... Usually the case. Doo -doo -doo. Yeah, so there's a bunch of windows, a bunch of, um... Was it mainly window, windows, doors, and stuff? It was like break. windows and openings, and I was just clipping through all of this. I think I needed to be Pumpkin Banjo to get that one. This was the last thing you got. Yeah. Because we ex we, we exited the world, and it's like, one out of two. It's like, and then we came back in here, and it's like... <laughs> it's, people can't see my face, but... He was making faces at me, and I kept doing that over and over again, because... I'm too, I was too, I'm too used to like ledge grabbing, so in this game, you know. Hey, when Mario and every other like protagonist can grab ledge and he can't, <laughs> that just says something. I mean, have you seen Bear Claws before? It's true. Sure, they can climb a tree, but. This one, it was this spot. Oh, it's serious. Take two. <laughs> and I got hit. <laughs> I can't believe that actually worked. Here we go again. Here we go again. Jesus, come on, yeah, man. Uh, you come did, on, man. If there was like a, if, <laughs> if you should have seen his God, face, this, he was like this, really triggered by that. Like that, if it was the trigger meme, that would be like right here at this moment. <laughs> like, bro. Like, <laughs> there we go. I had to edit so much. This was a fucking platforming issue. I was just like, come on, Jesus, come on, come on. And then going back to editing this, I'm just like, oh yeah, that's right, that's just tilting me so much in this fucking world. Yeah, basically, it's the trigger meme every time. <laughs> it's, I mean, like, to be fair, like, I grew up playing platformers and whatnot, you know? So, like, I love, like, practice playing platformers, but, you know, I hear it's just like, oh yeah, I love Banjo. <laughs> Fails at Banjo's platform, I'm like, come on, it's just... It's kind of like, it's kind of like when I get uh, Philippe shit, it's like, it's like, uh, in Kingdom Hearts 1, if a Philippe at some point said like, I have all Kingdom Hearts 2 cutscenes, uh, said burn into my, um, burn in my, um, burn in my head or whatever, right? So he like knows all the cutscenes. We had to do the Kingdom Hearts 2 playthrough with Philippe, and Philippe's all like, oh, what's gonna happen? It's like, Philippe. <laughs> like, he told me he knows the cutscenes, but then like, what? 90% of the cutscenes is like, you get surprised. I'm like, Philip, don't you know what's gonna happen here? <laughs> no, did you play like the remix or the original mix? Original, but like the remix still has all the original cutscenes. Mm -hmm. They just added, added cutscenes, you know? Hmm. I mean, <laughs> I guess that's. Yeah, I know. Um, 
Yeah, no, Jesus has like three parts dedicated to fucking Monster Mash. <laughs> yeah, I know. Well, technically two and a half, but more or less, you know. Basically. I had I had one and a half videos for uh for my for Gobi Desert, but like Jesus is like two and a half. I'm just like. <laughs> Basically. But to be fair, Jesus does get the job done, and like to be fair, he you know he plays his way, you know he plays carefully. Good for me. <laughs> he loves to live dangerously. I like to play safe. But even though my safety almost got me killed a few times. If you know what you're doing, you can ease up a bit. That's the, you know. <laughs> kind of like what Johnny says. If you know you get a, can get away with it, you can get away with it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. I um, think you can stop the recording right over here. Boy, anything else to add? Or? No, I got it. We're going to see you for part 12. All right, part 12 it is. See you guys. Uh, see you later.